The way to success is knowledge. You see, success requires you to take steps. Take action if you want to achieve your goals. However, the only way to make the right action is when you're well informed. To seek knowledge, you have to learn to read books. Anna Quindlin, an American author and journalist, said, Books are the plane and the train and the road. They are the destination and the journey. They are home. Dr. Suez once said, The more that you read, the more things you will know. The more that you learn, the more places you'll go. To succeed in any field in life, whether it is in your business or career, it is important to seek knowledge by reading books. So in this video, I'll share with you 13 business books everyone should read. If you're new here, consider subscribing so that you don't miss out on exciting videos like this. 1. The E-Myth Revisited Why Most Small Businesses Don't Work and What to Do About It by Michael Gerber Many workers dream of the day that they'll finally escape the employee life and become a boss of their own. As a result, they start their entrepreneurship journey. Sadly, most of the small businesses end up failing because they were built on the wrong motivation. This new entrepreneurs assume that they understand the technical work of a business. Therefore, they go into a business that does that technical work. However, here's something that they need to understand. Everyone who goes into business has three identities, an entrepreneur, a manager, and a technician. Your goal should be to work on your business rather than in your business. To do that, you need all the three identities to build a company that can thrive without you. Michael Gerber's advice in this book is to outsource work to other people whenever possible. Ask yourself, if you weren't there, would the business crumble without you? If the answer is yes, then find someone who can replace you. According to Gerber, if your business depends on you, you don't own a business. You have a job, and it's the worst job in the world because you're working for a lunatic. 2. The Power of Habit by Charles Duhigg Before writing the book, The Power of Habit, Charles Duhigg was a business reporter who had the opportunity of meeting so many business people through his career. Meeting with these people helped him realize that our habits can either make or break our lives and careers. Duhigg explains how our habits work with our brains. For instance, some specific triggers motivate our habits, so recognizing these triggers can help us get rid of our negative habits. So if you find yourself struggling to get into good habits like working out, waking up on time, or disciplining yourself, then reading this book may help you. 3. The $100 Startup by Chris Gullibu In this book, Chris Gullibu explores 1,500 entrepreneurs who started their business with only $100 or less but have been able to build it to above that makes at least $50,000 a year. How did they do it? Well, the book explains how doing a business that aligns with your passion in life can help you achieve your millionaire dream. 4. The 22 Immutable Laws of Marketing by Arias and Jack Trout The key takeaway in this book is that marketing is a battle of perception, not products. In a competitive online space today, everybody wants to be the first in the mind of their prospect. However, there's a tiny chance of achieving that if another company has gotten there first. What do you do instead? Aurelius and Jack Trout advise that if you don't get to a prospect's mind first, then you can create a new strategy where you can come first. If it worked for Domino's, it could work for you too. 5. Blue Ocean Strategy by W. Chan Kim and Rene Mabord You know, you don't have to spend all of your energy trying to beat your competitors all the time. How about focusing on making them irrelevant by creating a leap in value for buyers and your company? In this book, the authors Chan Kim and Rene Mabord explain the concept of a saturated market this way. Most markets are red oceans. They are full of blood because many sharks feed on the same small pool of fishes to differentiate yourself from them. It'll help to create a blue ocean for yourself an opportunity people can wait to dive into. 6. Write, Publish, Repeat by Sean Platt and Johnny B. Trompt When you write and publish a book, it establishes you as an expert in your field. In this book, Sean Platt and Johnny B. Trompt take you through the journey of becoming a writer. Even if you don't want to become a writer, you can learn how to make great content on the internet. 7. The Personal MBA Master the Art of the Business by John Kaufman Josh Kaufman a former middle manager for Procter & Gamble advises readers to skip expensive MBA price tag and create their program to learn about marketing, finance, and other business principles. 8. Built to Last – Successful Habits of Visionary Companies by Jim Collins and Jerry Porras In this book, Jim Collins and Jerry Porras dig from a six-year research project examining the everyday practices of the most outstanding companies. The book examines over a hundred real-life examples of successful brands 
and also provide framework to help entrepreneurs of all levels build a prosperous organization. 9. The 4-Hour Workweek by Timothy Ferris How do you start a business that requires little or no work from you because you are hiring people to get the job done? How do you work 4 hours a week? Well, it takes several factors to get to that level in your business. In this book, Timothy Ferris explains how. 10. Tribes by Seth Gooden Why is community so important in a brand's success? In this book, Seth Gooden takes his time to explain the importance of community and tribe in brand building and also how to find opportunities to cultivate that sense of community around your business. 11. Good Luck Creating the Conditions for Success in Life and Business by Alex Rivora In this book, Alex Rivora offers inspiration and motivation for people to believe in their business ideas and trust their judgments instead of focusing on the negatives. The concept of the book is that if you can dream it, then you can do it. Building a business is tough because it requires a lot of hard work, money and time. Also, to succeed, you must understand that failure is inevitable, so you should be willing to learn and try again after failure, not give up and throw it all out. When you decide to learn from every mistake, you'll eventually build an empire. 12. Become your own boss in 12 months. A month-by-month -month guide to a business that works by Melinda F. Emerson. This self-guidebook outlines the tasks you need to carry out to get your business off the ground. The founder and CEO of Quintessence Multimedia, Melinda Emerson, spells out the step-by-step -step activities you need to do within the first year of launching your business, from reaching out to venture capitalists or contacting investors and creating a one-year marketing strategy, to getting the right software and investing in graphic design. Following these tips will help you build a successful business in no time. Again, as an entrepreneur, building a successful business can only be achieved when you're knowledgeable about your industry, how to budget and invest, amongst other things. 13. Run and Grow a Successful Business by Toolkit Media Group This book is a good recommendation for an all-in-one guide to running your small business. In this book, you'll learn everything about setting up a business, from planning to accounting and staffing with handy checklists case studies, and model business plans to help you start and grow your business. Learning and applying most of the tips from this authors will help you as a first-time entrepreneur to build a successful brand and help you live the life of your dreams. Thank you very much for watching our videos. If you like this video, watch more videos on our channel and subscribe. We love you.